empty. It's past two, and everybody has gone home, many only our class. So if you want to go home and leave only me here, eh? You want to go home and leave only me here? Can't you see the work I'm doing here? But auntie, you're not doing anything now. Okay, you people want to go home, Abby? Yes! yes. I'll ask you a question, and anybody that answers it correctly can go home. Do you all agree? Yes! yes. Chibiko, you have 15 oranges. And you gave five to Precious. How many will be remaining? Fifteen. How? I am not going to give her Precious my oranges so. Because if she has her own, she will not give me. Shut up your mouth and sit down there. <laughs> Auntie. Uh -huh. The answer is ten. Good. Correct answer. Go and carry your bag and go home. Auntie, thank you. God bless you. You're welcome. Auntie, ask another one. Okay. What is 104 and 66? Auntie. Mm, success. CNN and Cartoon Network in our TV remote. <laughs> look at her head. Come and sit down there. You look like Cartoon Network. <laughs> Auntie, I. Yes, GBK. 104 and 66 is 170. Good. Correct answer. Go and carry your bag and go home. Yes. Okay, auntie, ask another one. Okay. There are five beds on the tree. If a hunter shoots two, how many will be remaining? Auntie. Or your sources? No man will you remain. <laughs> <laughs> Sit down there. Olodo. Auntie. Yes, precious. If five beds are on a tree and a hunter shoots two, three will remain. Good. Correct answer. Precious, go and carry your bag and go home. Let all these dumb ones remain here. But auntie, yes, success. If there are five birds on a tree and a hunter shoots even one, the rest will fly away now. <laughs> <laughs> success, no, it's stupid that will be remaining. But I like the way you think. Sit down. But that doesn't mean you're not dumb, Sha. <laughs> auntie, hmm? Can I ask you a question? Mm hmm. But if I ask you this question, and you feel it, I'll go home more. <laughs> what kind of question can you possibly ask me that I cannot answer? Auntie, if I ask you this question, and you feel it, I'll go home more. I do it or not. So says, ask your question. Okay. There are five ladies, and four of them are wearing trousers and shirts. But one is wearing gown. Which one is married? <laughs> the one putting on the gown, of course. Auntie, no. It's the one that is wearing wedding ring that is married. <laughs> but I like the way you think. But that doesn't mean you're not dumb, Sha. Now I'm going home. See you on Monday. If I don't go and marry, you think this class doesn't know that you are 25 and you are still doing boyfriend and girlfriend? <laughs> Anything. She didn't write anything, no. You, you say you wrote something, and she did not give your correct. I wrote something. You did not write anything. It's okay, it's okay. What happened? We were in the class today. Okay. I was teaching them Nigeria history. Okay. But I said we revision. Now, who can tell me when the Nigeria Civil War started? You. 1967. Clap for her. And who can tell me when the Nigeria Civil War ended? You. 1970. The war was between who and who? Yeah. The Nigeria government and the Republic of Biafra. The Nigeria government was led by who? You. Yeah. General Yakubu Gawon. The Biafra government was led by who? You. Yeah. Colonel Odumegu Ojuku. Now, who can tell me what was the main cause of this war? You. Violence and anti anti Igbo program in the north of Nigeria. All right. What did I teach you about war? You. What causes death? What stops development? War is not good. Very good. I'm impressed. 
All right, here is your test. Bring out your full scarf. Nigeria Civil War. Write an essay on your experience. Imagine you are in the Nigeria Civil War. Write an essay on your experience. This test carries 20 marks. Start writing. I said start writing! Can't you imagine? Come on, start writing! So, so says, did you write the essay? Yes, I wrote it. I don't know what she's holding her hand. You did not write anything. I wrote it. Okay, okay, okay. What did she write? Let me see. Look at what she wrote. She just wrote an index. She wrote, as we entered the war, I saw plane flying, fume, fume, fume. That's all. <laughs> what so says? <laughs> That's not a complete essay now. Because that is the only thing I could remember. Because before the war started, I died. Jesus! So what do you mean by you died? It's your imagination. It's you that is imagining. You say you should imagine. So that is the only thing I can remember. I died before the war started. <laughs> Nasio, you don't like to imagine a story. And now you are still telling her to imagine her imagination. It's your imagination. Continue. Okay, yes. I remember it's like I was in that imagination. So says died before the war started. And Jai! <laughs> This year just started. We can't, we can't start this year like this, eh? Please give this girl her mask so all of us can have peace. Eh? You know, I, I, I don't like coming here. And in my imagination, you not follow me to that wall. Hm. I died before the war started. You better give my complete my I'm not a light this on fire. Yes! 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 Auntie, you better give her a complete mark. Oh. It's people like you that used to cause problems in the Nigeria educational sector. You'll be, you, you be giving a, telling a child to imagine a war, as if he had been to a war. You people will be teaching children something they cannot use in real life. Better give her a mark. Oh. You, this auntie, you kept me in this school by this time of the day. You told a child to imagine war, and you're still telling her how to imagine the war? Have you seen war before? If I show you what, will you recognize it? In fact, you're fired. Mama! He shot you! You're fired! <laughs> Did I just say, ah? Uh? You're fired! Yes. Hey. I said, you're fired! You're fired! Actually, success did not call me to your office. It was her auntie that called me to your office. <laughs> and. Uh, auntie! Mm? I thought I had fired you before. Yes, sir, but you called me back. Uh. Mm. <laughs> okay. <laughs> this one you ask success uncle to come to my office. I hope all is well. Principal, all is not well though. Yeah. The reason why I invited success uncle to your office is to report success to you in the presence of her uncle. <laughs> Principal, this girl is giving me head echo. <laughs> what happened? Principal, can you imagine? Success is in a bad gang in my class. <laughs> me? Success? Bad gang? No. Eh, you mean so? Uh, <laughs> Auntie, no now. Seriously? <laughs> Come off it. Huh? How will you say this little girl is leading a bad gang in this school? Huh? She's just a child. Yes, exactly. I know that sources can be so many things, but not a gang leader. Oh. <laughs> eh, Auntie, tell us what really happened. Uh -huh. Principal, last week Friday, I gave them a test. You have 10 minutes remaining. And once it's 10 minutes, I'm coming to take your answer sheet. Whether you're finished or not. And if you get home, tell your friends that I refuse to resume school early that I've missed my test. Nonsense. In fact, I'm coming to your table to check if anyone is doing my practice in my class. Bia, what have you written? Nothing. So you mean for the past 30 minutes I gave you this question, you've not written anything? Not even your name? Hey. Hey. Hey, get out of my class! Get out! Now listen, if I come to your table and you've not written anything, I will tell you answer shit and you leave my class. Is that clear? Yes, Nonsense. Please, oh. 
Have anybody written anything? No. Uh -uh. Have you written anything? No. Ah, uh -uh. what are we waiting for now? Auntie, I'm leaving your class for you. If you people like you people should sit down there and write rubbish that is still fair, me I'm going home. I beg which kind of test is this? I'm principal. That was how all of them left my class. So. <laughs> Success! So you're not leading a protest in my school? No! So why did you tear your book and make others leave the class? Principal, I see a to say that if you don't write any message, that she will come to assist and tear our book. Uh huh. So I said, instead of her to come to assist and tear our answer sheet, let her just tear it at once. Uh -uh. Because you don't know what to write. Success! How do you say you don't know what to write? Principal, school just resumed now. Teacher has not taught us anything and she gave her test. Wait! You mean school just resumed and you have not taught them anything and you gave her test? Who does that? Uh, sorry, sir. Before we left for the holiday, we we'll asked them to study and teach themselves at home because the academic calendar will still be running despite the COVID. And you see, you cannot just come and give me tests when you do not teach me anything. Uh -uh. Since I'm the one that taught myself, let me give myself the test. <laughs> I agree. <laughs> I agree with her 100%. Since you asked her to teach herself, allow her to give herself test. In fact, let's make this thing to be fair. Once she's through with the test, I'm going to mark it myself. <laughs> so you will not come now and say that she wrote something that she's not supposed to write. Uh -uh. Do you think I like coming to this place? Eh? Don't mind them. That's how they will give you some more test without teaching the person. If God tells you like that without giving ten command, they want you to say your answer shit. Oh, oh. <laughs> I will come and be going to beg. I know you protest. Rice in the house, so I'll block like it all get. <laughs> <laughs> Hard if you want to make it in life. When I was growing, it was a bit difficult, but I had to try. When I was in secondary school, I worked really hard, I had to pass my assignments, I had to pay attention so I could make it, and I graduated with good grades. I made it into the university, and as you can see today, I'm a teacher. I'm proud of myself, but I'm still working hard because in future, I want to be a billionaire. Just like my uncle. Success, what did you say? You say you want to be a billionaire. So I say just like my uncle. Which of your uncle? My uncle K. Brown. Wow. Really? Yes. So, where does this year Uncle K. Brown stay? He lives with me. He lives with you? Yes. Can I meet him? Mm, why? Nothing. I just want to meet with him. Is there anything wrong with it? Mm, okay, I'll tell him. Are you sure? Yes. Thank you. So as I was saying, students, you need to work real hard if you want to make it in life. I'm going home. So when can I meet your uncle? I'll ask him today and get back to you. Are you sure? Yes, I will. Okay, you can go. Be a good girl. Alright, bye bye. Uh, 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 uh. Success, please come. Please help me give this to your uncle. Okay. Tell him it's a gift from your auntie. Make sure you give him more. Alright. Good 
laugh. And Success, laugh. how are you? Where is your headset? I gave it to my uncle. You gave it to your uncle? Yeah. So am I meeting your uncle today? Or then today, you meet him on Monday. On Monday? Yeah. Mm. Okay. You can go. Uncle, okay, good afternoon. Good afternoon. You already back from school? Yes. Mm-hmm. Uncle, do you want that bean that was about to sour? Yes, I want it. I even added pepper, thyme, and some other beautiful spices. If it tastes the, the thing is delicious. Okay, that's what I'm going to eat now. Okay, no problem. Go inside and eat. But remember, for me, I've not eaten. No. Success. What are you doing here? Is this where you live? Yes. Success. Who is this? This is my auntie. Oh, your auntie. Auntie, good afternoon. Where is your uncle? This is my uncle. No. Where is your uncle that is a billionaire? Hey, uh uh. I don't have any billionaire uncle. Wait. Success. You told me your uncle is a billionaire. Me? Hey, success. Please, which of your uncle is a billionaire? Oh, my uncles are poor. <laughs> they don't have shishi. But success, when I told you I wanted to be a billionaire, you said just like your uncle. Okay. And to that time, you said you want to become a billionaire. Then I now say like my uncle. Because you want to become a billionaire too in the future. <laughs> it's not true. <laughs> hey! My phone, my electric scooter, my headset, where are they? <laughs> okay, success. Is this the auntie that has been giving us all those things? Yes. <laughs> auntie, thank you very much. I've actually sold out those things. <laughs> That's the money we'll be using to feed ourselves all this oh, while. No. Uh, thank you very much. Eh? Uh, but when are you giving us another gift? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I thought my uncle is a billionaire. <laughs> That's why you be giving us those gifts. See, Auntie, is someone speaking English? You listen. If you don't understand, do you ask question before you can fall your hand in public because of common English? <laughs> yeah, you know, your body that shaking. I'm not saying anything. Yeah. God, I can't believe I fell for this. Auntie, success told me that you like me. <laughs> <laughs>